Hi friends. This is a trip from a couple of years ago when we drove up west of Tucson through part of Saguaro National Park. On our way to dismantle a couple of greenhouses. Is there any reason at all to label these where they came from? The reason we are reviewing two-year-old clips is because we are now getting ready to put these back together at the ranch. Well, three long, hard days, and the greenhouses are disassembled. They're gone. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. And two years later, we are getting prepared to reassemble them. First step is to make a place for them. This is uh, up on the hill behind the house here on the ranch. A road grader always reminds me of a praying mantis, the way it can articulate its body in so many different ways. We've got a foundation poured and I haven't been making videos because Lynn and I are going back home to Mexico in about a week and we'd like to get this as done as possible before we leave. We've just about worn out a tape measure getting this thing square to fit the greenhouse perfectly. Well, we made some progress on the greenhouse. We've got the uh, side benches built. Got the guy who's going to do the rest of it designated. Hi, Mom. Skylights are in. Yeah. Just putting up panels. Very interesting cloud formations today. I'm not sure I've ever seen clouds like that before. They look like waves. Hmm. If anybody knows the name for this, let me know. Some of that up above there looks like what they call popcorn clouds, but waves? Never saw that before. Don't think I have. We're up above on the old railroad track berm. Eventually we'll use this up here for water storage tanks and uh, solar panels in order to give us pressure and electricity in the greenhouse. We have one greenhouse done. And parts and pieces for one more. Ooh, somebody in there. Hello. Hello. And we have... Uh, the bench is built. Yeah, looking good. Oh, not quite done. Three pieces to go. Nothing blew out in the wind last night. Temperature is uh, 72 degrees. That thermometer has been 72 degrees every time I looked at it for a week. Peter and Kelsey looking towards the future. And what I see in my future is tomatoes. Hi friends. Well, that was Wednesday about noon and these next clips are five o'clock the same day. Uh, if you've watched my videos for a while, you've figured out I'm back home in Mexico. Today is the next day, Thursday. Don't get my nose on It's the only thing in there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>
Tucson. Only this little curtain between us and first class. That doesn't fill me up. Oh, that doesn't what? Fill you up? Right. What does that mean? Good stuff to eat. I'm not. Yeah, you are. I got cookies in my briefcase. Girl oh. Scout cookies. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, four of them. Well, how many did you want? I've got nuts, cheese, donuts, Girl Scout cookies. Ain't that grabbing you? Girl Scout cookies. Well, that's why I started with those. An hour layover in Phoenix. Really good Italian sub. Spicy. How's that? Airline wheelchair service is such a blessing. And, of course, uh, always first on the plane, ahead of priority and first class boarding. All right, watch your step, okay? Thank you. You're welcome. Potable spirit, no lock. Number 12. Arizona sunset for a while. Sometimes in Guadalajara, you do get right up to the terminal, but most often you have to come down the stairway from out of the plane and get into a shuttle uh, to get to the terminal. Of course, this is all a uh, wheelchair for Lynn and a guy to help us, so all is well. First, you go through immigration to make sure you have permission to be in the country of Mexico, and then pick up your bags, go through customs, come out here and wait for your taxi. Taxi to uh, Ajijic from the Guadalajara International Airport is 520 pesos, which is currently about $31. We got home at midnight in the dark and woke up here to continue our retired life in Ajijic. Mexico and uh, I am looking forward to sharing it with you again. Hey, if you 
you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.